looking a hot ass mess in her makeup videos but it is true yes but y'all let's just ignore that i'm gonna fix it up by the end of the video i promise but anyway let's just get into what we are going to be doing today as y'all can tell by the title and of course the thumbnail we are going to be doing makeup with the crayon case y'all this one right here yeah i told y'all in a few of my other videos i've been going crazy with makeup and of course the crayon case had another sale and I couldn't pass it up. This one right here is the box of crayons and this is what it's looking like inside of this palette. Definitely excited about using it. Even has a big, big mirror, y'all. So definitely hyped about that. In this video, I am gonna try to stick to most of the crayon case products that I do have. I don't have everything, y'all. So this right here is another one that I picked up a while ago. This is the Watch Me Blush palette and I will be using some of these on my face, of course, to contour and some blush. So yeah, I also have the matte book, y'all. I'm gonna try to stick to the eyeshadow just using the box of crayons. So, um, so far I have my face moisturized, eyebrows already done, and of course my lips are moisturized. So yeah, um, let's just jump into this review and see what we can come up with. I have no idea, y'all. So. Crossing my fingers that we get a good look. So yeah, just continue on watching. So I did prime my eyes with my paint pot in laying low. And y'all, I don't know what I'm doing, but I think I'm gonna start off with this color right here. Called tan, obviously. I mean, that's the lightest color in here. And it's still kind of dark. So I'm gonna go in real light with this color. And of course the brush that I'm using is from the crayon case. This one has 01 written on it. And I'm just going to go in first pat 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 y'all know how I usually do. If you <laughs> this is your first time, yes, I usually pat 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 first because I do not set my um paint pot laying low. That's what I always use. Um with a setting powder. So, as you can see this color is kind of orange. So the next color that I'm going in with is called brown. And this is a brush that I got from Morphe. This is the M433 brush. And I am gonna concentrate a lot on my outer corners, but I am gonna drag it in and under the first color that I applied to my eyes. Smile, back in with the first brush, and I am dipping just a little bit back into the color tan and blending those two colors together. Yeah, I have no clue what I look I am doing right now, so, um, Let's try to spice it up a little bit with some deep plum. This is what that color is looking like right here. And this is a crayon case brush that I got a while ago. I'm gonna go ahead and use this right here. Taking that brush, of course, going under the brown color and concentrate on the outer corners once again and dragging it in. And then I will be going back and blending all those colors together with the first and second brush. So I decided to go ahead and do a cut crease, y'all. So if you have um, hooded eyes like me, this is a good tip on how to get it as accurate as you can. Yeah, my eyes are not shaped the same, the hood. So yeah, it's a little bit of a struggle for me sometimes. So I decided to go in with this white color and this is a crayon case brush. It's just a flat brush. I forgot the name of the brush, y'all. So I will put everything in the description box below. The pigmentation is so real, y'all. I didn't even need to use my finger. It was popping already. Still don't know exactly what color I wanna go with. I think it's gonna either be this orange or gold. Um, This is what they are looking like. This one or this one right here. Uh, I'm having a moment. <laughs> so I decided orange. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so because I wanted to use both of those colors, I think I am. I'm going to go ahead and clean off this brush, and I'm going to add the color yellow or gold to blend out these colors together. So, yes, I mean, why not, right? I want them both on my eyes. Anyway. So you're about to see me just go from 
brush to brush and blend all the colors back in. And of course, I'm gonna use my fingers too just to make sure these lines are gone. Okay, y'all, this is what I am looking like right now. And so far, I can tell you that I am really, really enjoying this palette. Um, as you can see, we do have some fallout, which is not a lot in my opinion. This is what my palette is looking like and the fallout on the palette, which is not bad, y'all. So um, the palette is pretty good, y'all. I really, really like it. So obviously, I need to do the rest of my face. I'm going to go ahead and do all that. Most of it off cam camera, but I will leave everything that I'm using on my face in the description box below. So definitely check it out, especially if you are close to my skin tone and you want to kind of gauge what colors that I'm using on my face. Definitely check it out. So yes, I'm going to go do my face and we'll be right back to finish the eyes. I forgot that I want to show y'all a little snippet of some of the products that I'm using, especially since I will be using the Watch Me Blush to contour and to put a little bit of blush on my face. So far, so far, give a paper green can fly. Then forever doesn't feel that far. So far, so far. And this liquid eyeliner is from the crown case. I really, really like this. Okay, y'all. So as y'all can see, I am in a whole different area. I had to recreate this look, y'all. This is a whole different day. I did lose some footage the ending of the video y'all like seriously i was very frustrated but this is a recreation of the look hopefully i got it the exact same way but if not it's close enough so y'all um the only thing i have to do is finish the ending which is the lower lash line lipstick and that's it so it's not that bad at least it's just the end of my video but anyway let's just finish so let's get into the lower lash line Pushing me backwards into your bed Baby, you are all I need But I don't want to dive too deep, too deep I can feel the tension Another bottle of this wine I'll be up in your space Love and affection Ain't got nothing on me No, that's not what I need Maybe on another day I'd encourage you to make me stay, but baby, I'm just trying to numb my brain and wrap my head around this whole thing. When you're kissing my neck and grabbing my leg, pushing me backwards into your bed. So this is the finished look and of course I really 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 like it. I mean Yeah, if y'all don't have anything from the crayon case y'all need to hurry up and go get you some because Trust and believe I will have many more products from them in my collection. Yeah, I am calling myself Going on a makeup hiatus and I said this last week, but y'all I end up breaking already and i think this is gonna be the last one y'all i end up getting the fenty powder foundation so you will be seeing a review coming from me with that product probably next week sometime but y'all i'm serious this time no more makeup for a while i am gonna be doing a lot of tutorials when it comes to makeup because um yeah i have a lot of makeup a lot of palettes and it's just ridiculous but um i'm gonna go ahead and end this video please like subscribe and of course comment let me know what y'all think about this look let me know what y'all think about the crayon case, period. And I will see y'all in my next video.